Hey guys, welcome back to another video and we're at the house right now. We're getting ready to go fishing at a haunted, on top, on the side of a haunted mountain. We're fishing a reservoir and it's a mountain where like all the Salem witches were buried and it's like haunted. It's a haunted mountain. And so I feel like the fishing would be good because not that many people know about it because it's kind of hidden. Um, and uh, I feel, I feel like we're going to get fish. Last yesterday that video you guys watched so it's yesterday from that video you guys saw if you didn't go see it go watch it it'll be at the end of my video i always link that so i don't think there will be small mouth in here but i know for sure there's large mouth okay so we're literally on our way and look at this it's just straight for us and this is super long we've been on this road for like five minutes this is just so crazy look how small this road is that we're actually on to get here. We've been on here for a good minute, so I mean, it's pretty hidden. So we made it to the lake, and oh my gosh, was this road bumpy. We've probably been on this road for a good two miles. Oh, five miles. Five? Good five miles, like this narrow road. And now we're finally here, and that's the lake. I'll give you a better look when we get up there. So here is the reservoir, and it goes out that way, so. It's pretty big, and the water's actually n nice and warm, so that'll be good. Now we're gonna go get the kayaks. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Like this. This little part right here. All right, got this set right here. I got the Savage Gear um, 3D Bluegill. Try to fish this cool grass line. Then I'm gonna go over there in that little cove. Here's this little tiny guy, guys. <laughs> Absolute toad. Absolute. Guys, I did not think about it, but that was my first Massachusetts fish. And it was a large mouth. Hopefully, I can cut the smallie. I don't think they have smallies in here. If there is, that'd be awesome if I could catch one. So I guess there's not very big fish in here, according to one of these guys. Oh, I just got a, oh, I got a big bite. Let me throw that right back in there. So one of these, one of the locals here, he said there's not a lot of big fish, and they're pretty rare. Like, so he said like a lot of one, one and a half pound fish in here. So, oh, wind's starting to pick up a little bit. Whoa, a lot. It's, it's pushing me like I got my own trolling motor. How can we get any bites, really? I think I'm gonna switch to the Florida Old Faithful Texas Rig Zoom Trick Worm. 
That thing works wonders in Florida. That like every every bass in Florida loves that. This is the trick worm Texas. I mean the Texas rigged trick worm. I only have one more of these left, but I do have some senkos, so I can do a Texas rig senko. Know for sure. There's a fish in here. There we go. Oh, I know for sure that was a bite. See, I told you, I told you guys there was some fish in here. That, that got a bite, definitely. For sure. Swim bait, so it does all the action for you. Now you can watch me catch fish. I caught one fish in the jerk bait, and then I got a lot of bites on this. But they're small. They have to be small because I can't hook them. I got one. No! That was a weird bite. I didn't feel him hit. Okay, so I almost have two fish. So I have one. I, that was so weird. He didn't bite. I didn't feel him hit at all. And the line just got heavy. Thought I was, like, going through some brush. That was a little bit better than my first one, though, that one. That was weird. He didn't. I didn't feel a bite. The line just got heavy. I got another one. Better one. Here one pop. Huh? Here's this little guy. Oh, he's... Oh! Quick This one fought pretty hard. Small though, so... So small. He's a shaky little guy. Okay. had to switch up my GoPro batteries. That fish is good. Just went, it took him a, took us a good, I, I almost thought he was going to die because it took us a little bit to get, to revive him. Uh, so I've got four fish so far, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, four. This is my last worm and he kind of tore it up a bit. I think I'm good, I'm good though. Alright, let me get out of here because he came in here so I can get the hook out. I got a really cool picture of my GoPro. Alright, let's head in. We got here 3:30, and oh my gosh, sitting you cannot sit in a kite for this long. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to just stand up. <sighs> at least I caught some fish today that weren't very big, but at least I got my first Massachusetts Massachusetts fish because we're still in the search for the small ones. kayak for like three hours. I just can't wait to stand up. Oh, oh my arm, my legs. So that is the end of the video, guys. Um, at least I caught my first Massachusetts fish. 
went kayaking. I am B. We've been out. It's we got here at six. Uh, we got no. We got here at three thirty, and now it's six fifty. So a good three hours. Gosh, I am B, guys. I am B. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, get ready for some more content. And this place doesn't look haunted at all. Well, during the day. I don't. I haven't been here at night, but I've heard a lot of stories about up. It's called. This is Washington Mountain. Heard a lot of stories about the Washington, uh, like the graves and stuff. That's like the haunted part. It's like in that direction. So this was fun. I had a great time. So don't forget to subscribe and you know what? Go follow my Instagram. It'll be right here. Follow my Instagram. Just go do it. Go follow me right now. And then don't forget to subscribe and like this video. Just show me some support, guys. Thanks for watching. Peace. Yeah.